What's up, YouTube? Um, it's Grizzy. Um, sorry, my hair looks a little disheveled. I um, was in the hospital last night, so kind of passed out right when I got home, so I slept for like 11 hours. It was pretty sweet. It was awesome. Um, so yeah, I uh, just want to give you guys an update. Um, I realize I don't have very many viewers now. Hopefully it'll change soon, but um, basically what's going to happen is uh, I said in my first video that I was going to do a different theme every day. And I've figured out what that theme's gonna be. Monday's gonna be movies, since it's right after the weekend when it uh, all of them premiere. Tuesday's gonna be sports. Wednesday's gonna be life, like personal vlogs, personal views on things, all that stuff. Thursday's gonna be gossip, and then Friday's gonna be like follow Friday, like on Twitter. Um, so, yeah. So I just wanna let you guys know about that. Um, give you guys an update on that whole thing. Um, so yeah, today is Thursday, and um, I just heard a story about a. Uh, a guy, I, I can't believe this, um, uh, VH1 just pulled a show called Megan Wants a Millionaire, um, uh, because one of their contestants was, um, his wife was found inside of a dumpster, <laughs> and he fled the country. Seriously, VH1, how hard is it to screen these people? Like, honestly, I know that you're looking for ratings. This is ridiculous. How in the world do you find a guy like this? I mean, he, you, you, he ring him in, and he's probably thinking, oh yeah, yeah. You were like, okay, he looks a little sketchy, but that's fine. I mean, he has a wife. Why is he on this show in the first place? Like, do you guys not look at these things, or you're just like, oh, you want to be on the show, you want fame, you want to, you want to completely um, embarrass yourself in front of everybody? Then fine, you can come on the show. I don't really care. Really. VH1, NTV, all of those shows, first off, in my opinion, they're all terrible. They're only looking for ratings. I see absolutely no reason to watch them. Um, I understand that that is what your main viewing audience wants to see, um, but I really, I would rather watch I Love the 80s than Flavor of Love Part 8. Just because he can't get a, a steady relationship doesn't mean that you need to keep the show on. Um, but yeah, I mean... Gosh, I just can't believe that <laughs> that you. I don't. I don't. I'm just wondering where you find these people. Like, it's just insane to me. I don't understand it. And <laughs> um, yeah, it, this just blows my mind. I really cannot believe that <laughs> somebody like that would be able to. I mean, how somebody like that gets through any form of a um a br uh, um a background check. I just can't believe it, so, I mean, those are my thoughts, what do you guys think about it, I mean, do you guys agree with me, do you guys think that it wasn't VH VH1's fault, this guy just kind of snapped during taping, um, I'm just wondering, I mean, this is just my view, if you have different views, then sweet, I mean, um, I'm willing to hear those, I want to hear them, I mean, this is just my view, so, yeah, let me know in the comments, um, video response, something like that, and, um, I'll see you guys tomorrow with Follow Friday, peace.